No, they're actually all in sewers. Uh, making to make a play in there. There is some trades already. Though Zest takes out Love Heavily, but not before he takes out RB. Oh, yeah. So some early trades there on sewer side. Not going to be too impactful at the moment, but look at how much defensive utility is stacked up on the A side. Um, mm -hmm. But the, with the players already coming out here through new gen, um, trying to back up Patipan a little bit here. After, of course, they did lose the Love Family a little bit early on. He's uh, maybe just going to be uh, leaving a little bit more exposure on the C side, as we can already see the rotation coming out here. Mm -hmm. I like that there were three players from Myth already going to be around Garage and C uh, previously. That allows them to overload and uh, rely on the delay exactly. um, offered by the utility. Well, my favorite gun, Shaldi. Shadows it's being utilized right now by Omen, I believe. Uh, Boom, Rafa is just holding the angle there. They actually smoked up C already. They're left. gonna make the entry there. Uh, boom, he needs to run. He gets spots out by the dagger as well. That's gonna be a double pick and down he goes. But not before he takes out King. That's a power shorty. But they will be able to get the plant down now. Yes, once hold out window there. Spots out Sova and Mushroom is dead. Oh, Mushroom not having much luck there. Now look at them. They're trying to go and retake site there while they overload on Garage. But they're going to already be moving down long. And the, the stick here actually going down, I think. But uh, this is going to be Patipan still trying to ingress here onto Garage side. Not able to get past stacks, however. Mm -hmm. And now this is going to be a real precarious situation. Two players on low HP for Vision Strikers. This could potentially be doable. He's actually going to be charging into the two players here. Not able to get down Glow. Glow with the jumping right click this from time to time. But they do need to get something from this round. It's going to be really important. But it looks like the Love family not going to have that much luck. I think he was blinded there by the flashpoint. Stack's also going to be moving in. Patipan not going to be able to sustain in this battle. New Gen actually going to take up this heaven position. Not sure if the snapshot's going to be able to come out effectively. There's still going to be uh, relatively strong, longer range weapons like the Bulldog already mm -hmm. in play here as part of the anti eco. The New Gen is holding up a Bucky and he's up on heaven. There's no way she can take fights over there. And Myth is already down two people. And VS already got an another successful plan. So we'll see how they're going to factor back in for uh, round number three. But VS already looking so strong early on. Yeah, and uh, they're already going to be locking down this site. But I think at the very least that uh, myth attitude, they can probably hold on to these buckies for the next round. Seeing as how they did buy them, they wouldn't be able to get a full buy next round anyways, uh, unless they won the round. And this can still be a bit difficult. And honestly, this is how Myth Attitude now. This is going to be a retake scenario at the moment here. Two players piling in here through inter uh, connector, But Kevin is also going to be overloaded a bit now. Info is out here after the Silver Dark going out here. But Stax, he's going to be able to get the first one. And look at all the smoke coming out here as they're going to start creating a lot of space here from in front of the A ramps here. Mushtoom will be able to get one, but he's going to be taken down here together with New Gen. Only two players left. And now they have to make a decision. There's not going to be really that much more impact that they can make. There's probably going to just be trying to catch the exit kills in the form of the La family. He's all the way here in heaven. But oh no, he's going to get tapped on right there. Yep, I'm, yes, like I said, so strong even in the third game. Um, it was funny because the jet, I believe it was, uh, <coughs> sorry, it was new gen, all right? She was only having the bucket to use light. So she dashed in, couldn't find anyone, and actually got sprayed down by someone us using a phantom. I don't really remember who. So it's hilarious that they carry forward myth now. They can congregate from both A and C. It's the first B plan we've seen today. Zest actually takes out Boom Rabbi. In the meantime, though, taking down one defender. Um, they are going to rotate one from windows, actually. Zest is from there. Probably that's where he picked it up there. Glow is just chilling on gongs. Um, probably try to cover both angles though. Does he have dark cover still? He needs to just to smoke off the link. Well, he's just going to be biding his time for right now. They haven't moved in on the site yet, but New Gen, he's going to be able to spot him out. He knows what's up. And look at this. The coverage here from Zest is going to get caught out there by Mushtoom. He's going to have coverage as well from the Love Family as now. They're all moving in. Look at the Rolling Thunder. Going to knock them off the defuse. There's not a whole lot of time left here. He's going to be focusing on the objective. He's going to try and get the, isolate the players here. It looks as though they're not going to be able to stop that. And now, looks like Myth here going to be dropping yet another round. And uh, yeah, I think it mentioned that this is a VS uh, favorite map. They did pick a Haven to start this off, right? Oh, Patipan though has other ideas. They're going to be going for this aggressive push out. Actually catches King off guard and that's a spike down here. They're trying to close in on him and prevent him from getting any more positive trades here. It's, uh, they just want to try and clear the back line as fast as they can. But look at that. Patipan getting value here. Going to take down stacks. But the pressure is going to be on. Mushtoom has actually managed to uh, close a bit of the distance really limiting the amount of space. The Love family also moving up right next to the A lobby side. 
and just there's not going to be a lot of opportunities for them mm -hmm. to get out. This is going to be a real good chance here for Myth to really come back in this game. Yep, suddenly uh, it seems very good for them. Um, there's only two people left on VS Alive and they're just chilling together, maybe make some uh, slow Cover rotations. Uh, they can still afford to split this big, especially Haven is such a huge map. We do see Dark Cover left. Crowd to see, so maybe they got some Cover information for there. Uh, we see another smoke coming out. They really know. Depend. Look at the position of how the smoke comes out. They know they're on C main already. Here comes the teleport. The uh, recon One actually not going to spot him out there. Thank you for the area view. Boom, right, spots out. Zaz with the uh, judge gets him out there. But New Gen also takes out Glow. That's the first game they're going to hold off the series. The lockdown going to be a perfect counter. And the plan is going to be successful as a result. The retake not going to be very strong here. And I think they weren't anticipating for that here. And now... This is not looking good for mid. Oh, very, very nice kill out of those Nano Swarm. Though they get the blind kill onto Pazifan up there. RB doing work, but not before getting knifed down by New Gen. They're actually dropping left and right. Here comes the aftershock though. She knows she's in the corner. Does she able to get one pick? There she does. Stacks goes down. Glow also takes out Mushroom in the meantime. There is an op on Omen. Actually, that's a pistol. That's the pistol, my man. Classic gets him out there. Can he get the defuse off in time? That smoke, that's Kalpus. He needs to spray a little bit more. Not really sure where that is. He's really, really low. Yeah, this is the very uh, uh, typical dark cover that we do see, either for faking out or really delivering on these C long pushes. But oh, it's going to expire here. And look at Boombarapa taking full advantage. Patipan as well. Going to be closing in there, also in support. Look at that. He's going to be able to get the second. Looking for the third. Looks like Glow, though, is going to be picking up the double as they line up perfectly. Now, Yunjen, he still will be watching this avenue. But looks like the teleport is going to be going out all the way to A Heaven. And the Plan almost certainly is going to be going down. Oh, uh, actually, it's uh, under heaven. Actually, so I don't left. think anyone's there. He can actually Shadows force the plant there. But you said the lineup, right? It was looking so good for Myth, and then now of a, all of a sudden it looks almost fairly even. But you have to remember, both uh, Omen and Cypher is actually relatively low. Okay, on these one strikers. Um, if they're not careful, it's just one hit off of any gun at all, they would be taken down. Yeah, so now they are going to be pushing on site. This is still going to be a paranoia coming out. Maybe a little bit early here is not really pushing out, but oh, look at uh, the positioning by King. He is actually taking the aggressive angle. Mushtoom is going to mow him down there with Odin. Look at them all dropping down. Mm -hmm. They're going to be able to take him and looks like Myth bouncing back and they're going to have some decent weaponry as well and they're having the time to really... <laughs> <laughs> That's why you seem so, so much putting it up though. Here comes the plan to party Pan gets a headshot on one. RB with the knife takes out the family as well. All of a sudden Mim's defense is just crumbling but not before King takes out New Gen. New Gen with the, the, the pistol though onto RB but all of a sudden the Mim is just left with Mushroom on that Odin. Yeah, or the plant is already down. I'm not sure if they want to commit to saving this Odin, but then again, they could always get exit frags. Um, Odin is a monster at close range, uh, close proximity attacks. All right, uh, I don't think he wants to. He should commit to this defuse. So yeah, that's going to be a failed defense coming out from Myth Attitude, and uh, yeah, going to be a costly one at that. They give the operator over here to Vision Strikers. New Gen actually jump all the way down from Heaven to mm -hmm. just try and engage. He did manage to get a kill for his trouble, but. Uh, Probably doing more harm than good in this sense. Now Mush Tomb though, he's going to be able to get down stacks as he's going to be pushing out from Connector. Not going to have uh, much luck there, but yeah, I think Vision Striker really not going to be offering quite a bit of delay as mm -hmm. let's not forget they're not bringing the Breach, which could offer quite a bit more of utility in that regard. You know, speaking of... Uh, oh, yeah, like you say, Breach has a little bit more utility, but here though, like the Killjoy, I haven't seen much of her in effect though. Like we only saw one out so far, all right. But so far on holding site, it hasn't been that much effective. And now we, they already rotated both uh, Killjoy and Cipher to this uh, to A because they know how much they're going to zest. Takes out the mushroom. That's a really really huge pick. They haven't expected this though. But boom with the shotgun. The Judge, the Fury, but he drops in the meantime. This is just a powerful trace going left and right. And so far, Killjoy is slow, slowly rotating Jet as well from A side. New Gen actually gets the pick up on the King. That's really, really huge. Another one onto Zaz. Myth is doing it for this game. 15 seconds left on the clock here. I doubt that... Uh, I doubt that... I doubt that he has actually time to plant. Yeah. Yeah, this is not going to be too easy for him. He's actually looking for the exit frags, but he's going to get found out by the turret. Getting onto one, though. Let's just see. Drone comes in, actually spots out one. He's just make the push. He's not careful. He spots out the Cypher, gets the wall back in, and the Cypher is dead. And meanwhile, the Killjoy is going to run back on out. We do not. Like you, you talked about the Hunter's Fury. There's a zoning out. That actually gets another one. RB doing work 
Patipan drops in the meantime. VS is already in the zone. They can make the plant. One up on Heaven in the meantime. Omen and Jet rotating from behind. Here comes the dark cover. They need to try to get an entry. Once already at main, the sofa is just covering right there. There's another dark cover holding up on to boost. There's one on hell. Boom. Gets stunned up in the meantime. Jen gets a, actually he just shot through the smoke. But not in the not before Mushroom actually gets taken down by King as well. I'm not sure if King wants to. Uh New Gen is probably just gonna back up because he does have to operate them, maybe just looking for the safe. Yeah, not much more that he can do there. Trying to, you know, bring it home maybe on the, the next two rounds if they can. But for the time being, look like the hunt is on. But Glow is actually going to become the hunted here. Mm -hmm. as, uh, that's not going to be working out too well. But they are going to be able to close in on him. And yeah, the A push going to be really working out. I think uh, you know we see uh, Patipan getting out the uh, lockdown. But now it looks like Rolling Thunder actually going to come out there. The Love Family going to get caught out there. And now look at this. They're going to push a little bit into the mid side. But New Gen, he's got other ideas. He's going to shut down the uh, breach. Now... This is going to allow them the space. Look at this. RB already creating the space on A side. They already have the control. The rotation coming out all on the, the garage side. Plant going to be going down here again for Vision Strikers. Very nice. They're already on site though. One with the teleport. Uh, Jet already confirming site is clear. They get the bonk. Um, slowly, they have to walk and rotate. I'm not sure what the Killjoy is just chilling there. Maybe they're um, he's trying to catch out some lurkers. Um, but... Vision Strikers, man, they are at their prime. They're at the apex of their prime. Let's see if this kill or out actually does uh, um, any work. But nope. As you can see, well, that is the kill. That, that is the hunter story we talk about, right? Be able to take out the out. It's a perfect counter for that. But not all oh, the double oh. jets actually be getting frags here and there. And v Vision Strikers. All right. New gen still on that operator. Pratty Pan will probably get this defuse. Question mark? No, but not before RB takes him out. Oh no, he's just probably gonna exit. Just save that. Just save it. It's a knife versus oh. New Gen. That's a big clutch. Petition for breakfast, and now looks like the dark cover again gonna be working well for the attackers. And look at the tailwind inside the next one. But looks like RB, he's gonna get caught out. Boom Barappa has got other ideas, but now he's gonna get shut down. He doesn't have a lot of backup here from the rest of the team. But look at New Gen, gonna be able to land the shots there, but he's gonna get shut down and taken out of the air mm -hmm. as uh, the blade storm only able to pick up one kill yeah not before taking out omen in the meantime though the nano storm trying to uh, like zone them out in the meantime he's planting in a non a uh, non default spot at least the bridge is going to get crossfire though gets a blind onto one zone stopped him out they'll kill joy he's he's just absolutely getting spot left and right but what is going on myth at least at least they get this round turning out to a four it, it's still it's it's doable it's doable yeah so myth they have managed to finally get to logs now. They're going to be pushing in from the spawn side of things here. Stax uh, and uh, uh, Glow going to be moving in. They're going to be trading a few blows here, but looks like the plan might be able to go down. Spike is dropped for the time being. It's going to delay things ever so slightly. The remaining three players here from Vision Strikers all going to be coming for spawn. They're streaming Spike onto planted. site here through uh, Zest and also Stax. They're still going to be also in the back. RB moving in, but look at them. They're all going to get caught in the crossfire here. Zest picking up the double, and now RB is going to be able to pick up one more zest with the 3k here gonna be working excellently for vision strikers they're gonna be moving up here and taking the pistol round excuse me but that was a three-man fault line so a good bit of intel there and i think they're gonna be aware of the potential issues here on b but there's gonna be the paranoia available here for glow they're all starting to stream in here off the back of the dark cover but look at this all the way up on the high ground there zest and glow gonna be chewing them up and now only going to be Boom Barappa and... Enough for that operator. Let's see if this will make a difference. Oh, and oh. RB already going to shut down Patipan. And yeah, this uh, is not looking good. Glow also going to be uh, getting the support there onto A lobby and using that dark cover aggressively. Look at this. RB also going to be... Uh, no, sorry, not RB. It's going to be Zest here moving up. He's actually going to get the drone and get the tag there on the mush tube and he's able to spray him down through the dark cover. Look at Glow. Not able to get the TP up there in time. And now he's going to get taken down. But the Love family is still going to be hiding out here with Boom Barappa and uh, it's not looking too good here in this 2v4. Uh, how are they going to get this plant though? Uh, maybe make a fake. They faked B main actually. They probably rotate out through a C. Little did they know though. King. Oh, King on the place right there. But he gets taken out first, even uh, using both cyber cages. But hey, Stax is in no man's land. He actually got blinded. A very nice Hunter's Fury coming out. Just gonna zone it out, but not before they actually get the plant down in the meantime. So Myth still does have a chance to go on this, though. But they are very, very low. Oh, RB. 
Got the ghost. Kills off the family. There's only one myth left. Myth. Roman. Can he do anything? He gets spotted out. The answer. Do you complete buy? Then it's just game over. Yeah, you have to go for the winning plays, however. And now we will be seeing that stacks hiding out here in the dark cover. Able to surprise the love family. And it looks as though that, yeah, they're not able to adjust for that kind of play at the moment here. Under the circumstances now, stacks will be able to try and back up a little bit more. Glow is in support as he's going to be closer to the words that ailing side. But now look at you, Jen. Able to spray him down after the smoke dissipates. Yep, one by one to just drop in. RB gets uh, one kill up in the mid. That is, that, that's literally not what I want to see. Like, we got, they got the number advantage. RB gets another one onto Mushroom. And see, this is what I like to say. This is so, it's so insane. It's actually close to flawless every triple A down at the loop. Loses brackets final so which will have that coming up for you. RB spots out party right there. Actually misses that shot. Glow actually gets out of Nuge and RB finally takes him out. Double headshot there. And that's three men down for mid for AD. VS still five men left. Strong standing there. We got the drone coming in. Mushroom looking to spot out one. Gets actually was spotted out. I'm not sure if he gets the tag. He does get the tag though, but um they do have the number disadvantage and I don't know if they want to rotate from here. Uh, with the attitude, there's not much that they can do here. RB and Zest going to pick up another two. There's only Boom Barapa left. And look at the Blade Storm already out here for RB as he wants to right click. He has been in Pervious here to quite a number of the attacks that we've seen coming out from them, and he's going to be able to pick up the third frag of the round and the final.